Good day to you and welcome back to Mountain Blade Warband. Fred of Asgarnia here and it is that time once again. It is the time for us to shed blood, to slit gizzards, to, to, to slaughter, to ride around the countryside in search of, of slaughter. But that's been a while now. It's been a while since I recorded last. I'm badly wounded. Well, not badly, but you know. I've seen better days, so we're going to wait and river check for a, for a while. And once again, as you can see, we have the weekly wage deducted from our pay, but we still have a we still have a sizable we still have a handsome sum left. We still have a fair amount of money, so we're going to go sea raider hunting after this, because I'm confident our men can. Oh, well, I better better change that. Out of food to eat, and right now we need we need we need food. So we're going to get let them feast. We'll give our men a good feast. Give them some, you know, um, chicken, uh, some smoked fish. We'll get the usual rations, but, you know, we'll get more. 350 dinars. We'll feed them for a while. Keep their stomachs full and their bellies appeased. Now, let us go. We have a battle to fight. The really bold Sir Robin rode forth from River Check. He was not afraid to die, oh brave Sir Robin. He was not at all afraid to be killed in nasty ways. Brave, 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 brave Sir Robin. Oh, Sea Raider landing. He was not in the least but scared to be mashed. Okay. You approach the hideout. The Sea Raiders don't appear to have spotted you yet. You can still sneak away unnoticed. Okay, so we're going to attack. This could be a huge mistake on my part, but I'm confident my men can handle the Sea Raiders. Question is, yeah, we have... I've brought some of my, you know, I have some of my best men here to do the fighting. Because the Sea Raiders are strong soldiers. They're about the equivalent of these men. So we need to be pretty good at our trade if we're going to win. As you can see, I look like a total bamf with my boar spear. For me! Come on, lads! For my... You're a loser, not a sea raider! Come on! Dead! Ah! That's it! Come on, keep him! Got him! Let me teach the bastard to fight us! Sea raiders! These aren't sea raiders, they're a damn disgrace! Oh, it's out of the way! Oh, sorry! Oh, dear, you're one of mine! No, you're not. You're one of them. Come on! We have them on the run! Okay. This is a, this is a little bit underwhelming. I was expecting... I was expecting... I was expecting a much tougher enemy. And I better take out my, uh... Take out my shield. He's gonna get himself killed. He's a silly bugger. I bet he's a brave silly bugger. Let's get in there before he gets himself killed. Farbala! Two to four, I will take on the best of the best. Got ya! Got ya! <laughs> Slit the gizzards! There you go. We won. With the retreat cut off, the Sea Raiders fall one for one by one to your determined attack. The hideout and all their ill-gotten gains are now yours. Now this is why I did this. Sea Raiders, they are tough to beat, but they give brilliant freaking loot. Like look at this. Crude burn. I mean look at look at the stats. 38 to body armor. And only 21. This is much better than what I have. So this can go. Nordic helmet. Much better than what I have. 19 to head armor, 40 to head armor. This should stop me dying as easily as I have been. So now we're going to take all these stuffs. Uh, 12, 1. Yeah, what I have is much better. Sausages, which means good stuff for the, um... Which means, you know, fresh supplies. Good stuff. Plenty to eat. My men should be happy. Oh, I thought I'd sold all of my stuff, but apparently not. Okay. So as you can see, we're much better off now for that victory. And some of our soldiers are ready, for, are ready to upgrade. So, that's... 
Oh, I'm ready to upgrade. Well, that's a nice change. Okay, so Robin, upgrade. We took. We didn't actually. We didn't actually take much in the way of damage ourselves in that fight. So that's pretty good. Let's see. See, this is the trouble. When I want a good, when I want stats to level up, I can never, I can never remember what I need in this screen. So I should probably check. Now nah, I'm too hipster for that. Let's see. Um, inventory management. Yeah, I always find I'm lacking in that department. We rarely take prisoners because I have a bloodthirsty group of dogs as soldiers. So tracking. That's something I want. It'll let you see. That means now, whenever you're, whenever you're across the campaign map, you'll see footsteps, and that denotes where certain men are headed. So if I'm looking for bandits, say, I can follow these tracks and hopefully track them down. So, bit into one-handed, bit into two-handed, and then one into pole arms, because I'm pretty good with. I'm pretty good with a. Um, I seem to be pretty good with a. Vegas. Vegas. I thought River Chegg was in the hands of the Nords. Was that, was that my imagination? I could have sworn this city was in. See, as you can see, arrows. Well, those are our tracks, actually, and we're not very good at tracking. Uh, right. Let's see. We'll keep looking. We'll keep looking for them. Ah. That fucking flag. Ugh, I hate you. As probably a lot of people who don't live in Carlo probably hate it as well. You know, just for the sake of, you know, they don't like the Carlo football team. And football in this part in any county in Ireland is serious business. It's like American football in America. Or a local cricket team in Britain. I joke. I don't know, is cricket as much of a big deal as... Well, actually. <laughs> I don't know, I don't think so, actually. I honestly don't think it is. Maybe it is. But we we Englishmen aren't very good at it. I'm pretty sure England just lost in India not long ago. I'm open to correction, but I'm pretty sure that's how it is. Okay, we're gonna head up here. To, uh, Vercheg. It could be Vercheg. Vercheg. I'm assuming it's the German, I'm assuming the German pronunciation here. That's a nice banner. Albert Castle. Jack. Give me your... Oh, seven men. Nice. You know, normally... It's funny, normally these cities don't yield much in that sense, but occasionally you do get a good a city that has a lot to offer. Jarl... Because I can't... I'm, my German name pronunciation is horrible. Horrid. See? You can just see the bigger the arrows, the bigger the army. So, Vercheg. Now, it occurs to me that I... Well, actually, we'll go to the marketplace first, because I have stuff I need to sell. Uh, let's see. That can go, this can go, this can go. God knows... Now, fresh chicken. See, as you can see, as time goes by, the chicken will go out of date. And... Anyone here study home economics? Or study anything of that nature? No? Well, God help you if you eat anything that is out of date. You'll get food poisoning and you may well... Your bowels won't agree with you. So I'm going to see if I can find a better a better weapon. Because, I mean, I think this will give me a thousand dinars. So, let's see. Arming sword. Yeah, my bastard sword's all around better. Let's see. I might see. I'd love a heraldic mail, but it's not going to be as. It's not as good because I don't have. See, heraldic mail. It changes depending on your um. Heraldic mail. It change. The colors change depending on your coat of arms. But since I haven't got a coat of arms, it's not really the same. Now look at that. Two thousand and eighty for some gauntlets. It's not not worth it. Mail shirt again. Two thousand and eighty. I've got a cruel Bernie. Not too sure what it is, to be honest. Which is even better. Well, maybe it isn't. But... And then that might... Ah, look. It's a freaking disgrace. You're better off... At this level, you're better off just pulling things off corpses. But a horse now? Hmm. 
Mm, not really the best part of the country to get. Um... All right, let's go. I, actually, I've never shown you the the street view, have I? For those of you who don't know, and I've had, I know, actually, a friend of mine. He was, he was just saying about how one thing the game seemed to be lacking was any sort of you couldn't you couldn't walk around cities. Well, that was more to do with me being lazy and actually not showing it. You can actually enter the cities. See? Which is a very nice touch. You can... It's basically like well, an Elder Scrolls game. You can go up to, uh... You can go up to the various merchants, buy things. It's essentially the same... It is essentially... You can do in the city view, essentially what you can do as the, um... Oh, get out of my way, cart. Oh, it's an invisible wall! Die, invisible wall! Derp. Ah, I'm Hector of Troy! Fear me! But yeah, essentially it's the same as City View. So I'm gonna leave now. I'm gonna have a look for some more men and I will be back when we find some. Be right back! His head smashed in and his heart cut out and his liver removed and his bowels unplugged and his nostrils raped and his bottom burned off and his penis split and his- Right! I have decided that we shall undertake an epic quest. One of a very mundane variety, actually, in truth. But, in this game you can get uh, quests from uh, guild, from, what is it, guild masters and lords. So what we're going to do is, we are going to speak to the guild master about bandits. Just give us an opportunity to hunt some down. See if I can find the guild master. Which, weaponsmith. See, I have no idea where the guild master is in this place. Sue me. Uh, you. Nah, where is he? Out of the way, woman. Bloody woman! Ah. Now that'll be a direct hit. Yeah, come on. Ah, look at you. Look at you. You're on foot. Look at me with my badass sword. Chop. I don't. I'll, I confess, I don't really know the layout of Nordic towns. Not half as well as I should. I'll be back when I find the guildmaster. Give me a minute. Hello. How do you do? Hello, stranger. You seem to be new to Sargoth. I am the guildmaster of the town. Do you happen to have a job for me? One of the merchants here is looking for... No! No! Sorry, no, I am not herding cattle. Flip off. Maybe the king has something more noble. Now, you see, I'm not going to pledge allegiance until I build a bit of a reputation. So... Ooh, nice ponytail. King Ragnar. My name is Sir Robin. I'm King Ragnar, the ruler of the Kingdom of the Nords and the Lord of Sargoth. You may be of common birth, but I'm always looking for looking for good men to fight for me. Oh, well, thank you. If they can prove themselves to be worthy of my trust. Do you have any tasks for me? Ugh, I'm no errand boy. Hire a courier for your trivialities. I've come to offer you my sword in ba Yeah, see? You won't really... I'm... Do you have any tasks for me? No. Well, bugger you. That's all I have to say. Bugger you. We'll continue our quest. We'll go to Swadia. I know one of you, Haldar, or Sir Okart, as, as you'll be called now, was uh, pretty adamant that actually I swear fealty to Swadia. Something, a view which... I, something I would quite like to do. I've always liked the Swadians, although people say they're over, they're overpowered and overdone. But I wouldn't really agree with that, because whenever I play the game, the Swadians get their backsides handed to them. They get, a, they, they're like, the, they're like the Germans in the Second World War. They end up getting on, getting into wars on about three or four fronts and getting themselves slaughtered. Hang on a minute. I saw them too. I called it. Oh, mine. Come back here. Come back here, you bastards. 3.2, 3.5. No, we'll never catch them. Shame, really.
Okay, I think I think we'll call that a session because I want to get some medievals on and I'm on time constraints. So I'm gonna cut the recording here. Soon as we get to Jelbeggy Castle. Or unless we find someone in the next 30 seconds. No? Come on, somebody show their head so I can chop it off. I do love chopping off heads. Please. Nobody to kill. Well, fine. Perfect cavalry terrain, this. Alright, we're gonna cut the recording. So, this has been Fred of Asgarnia. Insane as always, and I must get rid of that Vega skirmisher. And I am signing off. Look at my badass new armor. What? You mean I could just... You mean I can just miraculously change my appearance if I wanted to? Well, that's news. Alright, I'm signing off. Goodbye. Tell me I could... I can change my name and everything. My god. I'm signing off.